Hey, what is up, guys? Alright, 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 I'm, I'm gonna stop being creepy now. Um, what is up, guys? Welcome back. So, I don't know why I did that. Uh, that, that was really what the fuck. Um, <laughs> so this is the, this is the, this, what video is this? Oh yes, this is a daily plans video. Yes, yes, this is that daily plans video. I'm really, really messed up in the mornings. My, my head is just completely fucked. Um, but, 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 but we are going to go over, uh, actually yesterday I basically, I spent all of yesterday raising him to five stars. I got him with some like random ge gems, uh, double attack and HP. And I've been using him to farm B7, basically. I've, I've been running um, my Dark Sea Star and these two and my Wood Hana. It's been pretty stable. It's been it's it's about four minutes a run. Um, it's a lot better than my old team because my old team that uses the Wood Nightmare took about seven minutes or something to do to do a run. Um, actually, no, that was before I raised her. I was using the water um, the water Miho. And that took seven minutes. So I decided to raise these two and um, basically use them to farm B7. So I can farm it really stably now. I haven't failed once and it's pretty fast. It's decently fast. Um, can definitely use some improvements. Probably if I had like a, instead of using the Hana, use another healer that has like a, you know, that, that has like a nuke tied to their heal. Something like, you know, maybe use my Water Nightmare, but um, She's still not that strong yet, to be perfectly honest. I still need to get her at the very least to Evo 2. And probably something even better would be to use like the the, the bolt wing or something if I ever decide to raise him. Um, so yesterday I pulled the Dark Cupid, which I don't have any resources to raise him with, because I you know I'm missing well, I can at least make him 5 stars, but I don't have the resources to make him 6 stars. I really do want him to be my next 6 star. Like, ideally, I really want, want him to be my next 6 star because of how well he scales with his own HP. Um, his aggression scales with HP, and his own his shield also scales with HP. So he's, he's definitely a really, really strong monster. I was pretty happy. Like, yeah, I was really happy, actually, to, to be able to get him. And... Basically, oh, he also has resist. He's not like other dark monsters. He's a, he's a healer type dark monster. So he has 10% extra resist. That's actually really, really strong. Um, so, yeah, I'm definitely planning to raise him to six stars very soon. I'm probably gonna gleam him to make him Evo two and save all my cupids to make him Evo three because he's definitely worth it. I think he's one of the strongest healers in the game. Um, definitely one of the strongest. Uh, so. My next big goal in the game probably is to work on Golden Speed 9. I need to build a fire team. I don't have... Well, I have a lot of strong fire units, but I haven't really built them up to to the level where they can clear B9. Um, probably need to re-rune these two. I'll probably run her leader for the for the HP leader. Actually, no, I, I don't think I need the HP leader. I'll, I'll still, still run my Dark Sea Star for crit leader. I'll run these two, and then I'm, I'm planning on raising a fire healer. Something like the Fire Mini Cat. I've, I've been planning to raise him for quite a long time. I think he's one of the strongest um, three-star fire healers compared to a lot of the other healers. He's like the best version of the fire one, in my opinion. He has Purification, which gets rid of neg negative effects. I can't remember which she buffs the, the fire one gives. I think it's like dots or something. I can't remember. But it's really annoying. Um, definitely want to get rid of that. He has a 60% chance to stack, uh, to, to inflict two types of sap, so that's really, really nice against the boss as well. So he's going to be able to deal a little bit of damage to the boss, like despite being a healer with through his saps, and at the same time he's able to um, cleanse any stuns, any weird random debuffs that aren't supposed to be on my team. So yeah, I also have him as a variant version, so I'm probably going to, probably going to just raise him. All the gem slots are really good, one of each. Um, I could probably 5 star him today if I really wanted to, but I do want to spend a little bit of time farming farming my, uh, just farming for gold, because I'm kind of kind of gold star because once I make my next 6 star, my like 1 million gold is going to be gone, so I won't won't be able to have enough gold to to do that. So I probably want to spend a little bit of time in the, um, actually, you know, farming, farming golems for a little while. 
And I think that's pretty much it. Um, that's that's pretty much it for today. So I'm gonna start working on that, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.